Hi, this is Philip Warbass with Warbass Design Studios in Santa Monica, California. And today we're going to look at MS tags, Microsoft tags, and some unique ways that we can use those to tie to live streaming video feeds. Today I'm going to demonstrate how television stations can reach an extended audience as well as create new advertising revenue streams and viral marketing campaigns all from the phone. Uh, what we have here is basically a digital one sheet that we've created for uh, Good Day LA. It's a Fox Morning uh, news show. And um, it, this uh, one sheet is digital now because we've, we've placed a Microsoft tag here with uh, two calls to action. The first is uh, to point your Windows mobile device to HTTP forward slash forward slash get tag dot mobi in order to download a tag reader if the user doesn't have one. And then the second call to action is to scan the tag uh, on this cup actually um, to watch Good Day LA. And where that comes in is um, right here. We've created the access point to um, these live streams we've placed on coffee cups. And the idea is, is that we'll tie these in to um, Pete's or coffee tea, bean uh, and tea leaf or one of the other large uh, coffee houses here in West Los Angeles and then uh, try to expand the campaign uh, throughout LA County. Um, so basically I'll show you what we uh, are able to do. Now right now um, Fox 11 is serving this stream with a Windows mobile server and we can convert the stream in order to make it work on iPhones, Blackberries, Samsungs and all the rest. But for now, uh, for demonstration purposes, we're going to focus on Windows mobile devices. People that are in the um, entertainment business in Los Angeles just assume that everybody is using an iPhone, and I love iPhones, but that couldn't be further from the truth. So we really do have a large market of people in Los Angeles that are on Windows mobile devices. And here we go. Uh, I've already downloaded a Microsoft Tag Reader, so I'm going to go ahead and open that now. And I'm going to take the cup and place it, it's, what it's done is activate the camera on my phone and I'm going to place the cup in front of the camera and uh, now it's, it's already scanned the uh, tag and it's opening up my browser and it's going to take us to the presentation layer for um, Good Day LA. Um, what we've got here is um, uh, put, created a brand identity here by using their um, photo and then um, we have the Windows mobile stream here we also have created a viral component here so that when people are on this interface, they can um, access Twitter feeds from Good Day LA, from Fox, from Jillian, and from Liz Habib, who is my personal favorite because I grew up in Phoenix watching her. And um, then I moved over to Los Angeles, and here she was. Um, at, the, at the bottom, uh, last but not least, is the advertising doc. And this is important because uh, um, Fox uh, 11 can say, okay, Chevron, we're charging you $30,000 or more uh, a week to advertise, and um, we can upsell that client uh, you know, on the mobile dock. We can say, you know, if you want to advertise uh, on our mobile applications, and that's another five, six, seven, eight thousand dollars $8,000 a week. Um, okay, so we'll take a real quick look at the um, Twitter feed just to show you what's going on. Basically, it just takes you to Good Day LA's mobile environment on Twitter. And we'll go back really quick. And we will scroll up just a little bit more to the most fun part. And hopefully the reception's good right now. So I just clicked to open the stream, and I'm going to say, yes, I want to run this system command. So what's happened already is it's, it's opened up my um, uh, media player, and it is trying to connect and buffer the uh, stream right now. So this is how it works. And what it does is it, it just gives us a brand new way to reach our audience when they're not in front of the television. So I'm going to go ahead and stop that. And we appreciate your time. One of the things that I wanted to mention is that in hindsight, we were looking at this campaign critically and trying to, um, trying to just smooth it out and make it better. One of the things that we noticed was, one of my designers told me, you know, when they're scanning the cup, we don't want them spilling hot contents on themselves. So that is a potential liability that can be mitigated by putting, a, a, obviously, a, a um, uh, cap on the top, whatever you call these things, it doesn't even come to my mind now, a lid, thank you very much. 
And um, it might be in the future that we can put the uh, QR codes on the, or 2D barcodes, um, including Microsoft tags, uh, on the lid. So anyway, that's just a, something to consider. And we appreciate your time very much, and we look forward to giving you another demonstration maybe next week. Thanks.